Uh, my name is Mark Carrington and this is an introduce yourself video for Steemit. 60 years is a, a lot of story to cover in an introduce yourself post so I thought I would do something a little bit different and just cover some of the things that I do that I, that I do online that I'm interested in and I'm passionate about um, because really what I'm all about is I'm passionate about sharing ways to live a healthier, richer and happier life, principally because I've been able to do that much for myself. So I'll start off, here you'll find my Facebook profile and it has a bicycle and an open road and a picture of a book. So I am a published author, so we'll see here is my book called The Banking Revolution, Salvation or Slaughter. It's a technical book about the role of technology as applied to um, British banking and I was one of the co-authors with two other gentlemen by the name of Tom Steiner and Philip Langeth. The other book which comes from two years ago which is up there on my Facebook profile, it's called The Inspiration Bible and it's a it's a book of stories to inspire people and my story is on page 360 and it is called Inspired to Ride. So it's all about my journey as a cyclist. So just a little bit about the background. I grew up in South Africa. I studied business, I studied law, and I studied accountant, and I worked as a management consultant. I moved to the UK, lived in the UK, and worked as a management consultant all across Europe for 13 years, and I now live in Australia. The second, the main part of that story is, is that at the second half of my time in Europe, I started with a bunch of mates a consulting business to compete at the top end of the management consulting world and in six years we built a monumentally successful business and we were able to sell it so that at age 45 I was pretty well able to retire so I am an entrepreneur and have proven what it can be what can be done and what it takes to do that my real passions though are cycling as you can see. You, I'm always pedaling on my bicycle and this road here is a road out in Western Australia at a place near called Wim Creek and I've cycled across Australia seven times. But more about um, the things that I am passionate about. So, so number one thing is I'm passionate about cycling. I also have a strong interest in technology so a book on banking and technology is no surprise and so what I've been doing in my retirement years is I focus on two things one is doing work on internet marketing and blogging and those sorts of areas and quite frankly I just have to say that I'm a frustrated blogger frustrated because I have so many interests and have not really been that focused frustrated because I'm not seeing strong ways to get rewards for the effort that I put in. And then I also manage all my own portfolios. So I may um, become a seasoned investor, a trader in Forex, in stocks, in options, in interest rates, in commodities, and more recently in Bitcoin and in other cryptocurrencies. So hence an interest in Steam is built on an interest and an involvement in Bitcoin. So you'll see that I, I blog on a, on a reg regular basis about Bitcoin. I have a chart here which is um, taken from my last video about the Bitcoin price and Bitcoin markets. So if I step across a Bitcoin cha uh, a YouTube channel my last four videos were about Bitcoin price, technical trading on Bitcoin price, but also about how to mine Bitcoin. So now let's step across to some of the other things that I'm doing. What I thought I'd do is I'd have a look at some of the my 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 Twitter profiles. I have a very large Twitter following and a couple of 
profiles. So this is my personal profile. It's called Mark S. Carrington. I have 34,000 followers and it mentions author, entrepreneur, passionate about sharing ways to live a healthier, richer and happier life. I'm always, I'm a fitness fanatic. I ride my bicycle pretty well every day. I'm a strong believer in alternative health. I believe the doctors make you sick because they're always testing to find out what's going on. I just live my life and let my body do the work. But maybe we'll just step across to some of my other profiles. I'll show two more. So we'll log out of there. I will log into this one here. It's called StratoCharge. I have a website that I'm sort of starting to work through. It's called StratoCharge Your Income. And here I have, we'll just go and get to the profile, business consultant, internet entrepreneur, a strong interest in copywriting because copywriting is ultimately all that we are doing as as, our, as we participate in the internet and on this profile I have 67,000 followers and we'll go across to the the next one of of interest to to you given that these are the things that I'm interested in it's called go for forex profits which is all about Forex, so building profits from trading Forex, Forex and Forex options trading. And my objective here is to help traders tame their trading psychology and to help you learn to trade with the experts. I have a number of blogs. They'll all take a little while to load up. I had them all opened up, but they'll take a little while to load. So one called go for forexprofits.com. And which covers a, um, a series of articles on automated forex trading using robots and how to succeed as a day trader, working out um, good timing for trades and articles about trading psychology and those sorts of things. I have a strong interest, strong and growing interest in Bitcoin, in Bitcoin and Bitcoin trading and Bitcoin mining. I've been mining Bitcoin for for nearly a year now, and I have been mining Ethereum for around six months. So my my website here and my blog is called Bitcoin Profits. is has lots of Bitcoin 101 articles. It has articles on how to profit from Bitcoin. And then it has articles on how to trade Bitcoin, as you've seen from my YouTube channel. The other things that I love to do, I love to cook. So I have a website um, and websites that relate to things to do with cooking. This one's called combcookinghero.com. I have um, websites in coffee where I am actually, um, there are articles about products that one needs to become a great cook or to deliver great coffee. I'm also a keen photographer and um, I take photographs on my bicycle rides. I particularly like taking photographs of wild wild flowers, especially Australian native orchids. These are remarkable flowers the size of a thumbnail. But I have a new interest in my photography is taking photography to the sky and to fly drones and to use that for photography. So they have a website and a blog dealing with the latest products in the world of drones. And then I said it was going to help people share uh, to live a healthier, richer and deeper life. I have a, a website, a blog called Breathe Your Dreams, and it is, it's ultimately it's a collection of articles dealing with the things that have bothered me in my time. Cures for depression, what causes depression, and as an example, but then also the way to do, to build cycling into, into your lifestyle as one of the ways to manage depression, one of the ways to grow fitter. So there are articles on cycle training. This website is still somewhat in development. That's why there aren't any pretty pictures. And then 
my real passion is cycling across Australia. I have cycled seven times across Australia and here's a website that I have built for a friend who runs a business called Cycle Across Oz. They are currently doing a trip from Port Augusta to Corumba, so right across the centre of Australia. I've chosen not to go because I've got some other things going on. I have a planned trip coming up to Japan and I'm also going to be cycling around the Netherlands in the middle in the latter half of September. And cycling has opened up uh, an important avenue for me is is that I um, I like to run charity events as part of my cycling endeavors. So for every cycling trip I do, I have generated significant contributions to charity from through internet marketing, through network marketing, through social media marketing to help causes that I've, I've got an interest in. And my main causes are children's cancer and helping disabled children get bicycles that they can ride safely. So that's an introduction to 60 years of life. What I'm really looking for out of Esteemit is a community to share these passions and a way to generate an income based on the quality of content because I do believe that I have large experience base to draw on. It'll also create a discipline for me to blog more and succeed more. I appreciate your time.